हेलो स्टूडेंट्स मैं सिर्फ डॉक्टर मोहम्मद अहमद आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू द एटीन लेक्चर ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स टू स्टूडेंट्स इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी हैव डिस्कस्ड बर्नोलिस इक्वेशन एज आई टोल्ड यू दैट बर्नोलिस इक्वेशन इज ए नॉन लीनियर इक्वेशन एंड फॉर सॉल्विंग दैट वी नीड टू कन्वर्ट दैट बर्नोलिस इक्वेशन विच इज नॉन लीनियर टू ए लीनियर इक्वेशन बाई यूजिंग सम ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन राइट सो इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस रिकैटिस इक्वेशन right so side heading is rickettis equation so any equation of the form y dash equals to p of x y square plus q of x into y plus r of x so any equation of this form is called as rickettis equation so you can observe that it's a first order equation and it is non linear because the power of y is 2 right it's a second degree term here in y so that is why this equation is a non linear equation the same thing that we have done in bernoulli's equation the same thing we are going to do for rickettis equation also we are going to convert this rickettis equation to a linear equation by using some transformation right so before that we'll we'll closely understand this equation see if r of x is 0 then what will happen see if r of x is equal to 0 for example then the equation will be y dash equal to p of x into y square plus q of x into y so if i rewrite this equation then it will become dy by dx minus q of x into y equal to p of x into y square so if you closely observe this equation this equation is nothing but bernoulli's equation right it's a bernoulli's equation with n equals to 2 right if r of x is 0 then rickettis equation will become bernoulli's equation right so this is the case if r of x equals to 0 right so in in rickettis equation r of x will not be equal to 0 if at all r of x is 0 then uh, bernoulli's uh, rickettis equation is become, becoming bernoulli's equation right so how to solve this equation we are going to discuss one problem in which we will see the procedure for solving rickettis equation so we'll consider the question see in the question along with uh, uh, rickettis equation one particular solution will be given and we will be asked to find the general solution so what will be given one particular solution will be given and we will be asked to find the general solution so question is find the general solution of find the general solution of y dash equals to 2x y square plus 1 minus 4x into y plus 2x minus 1 right we have to find the general solution of this if y equals to 1 is a solution of it see in the question we are given a particular solution so general solution means it will be having arbitrary constants here uh, arbitrary constants are not there in this solution y equals to 1 obviously y equals to 1 is a solution of this if you substitute y equals to 1 in this then lhs will be equal to rhs so y equals to 1 is a solution of this but not the general solution we are asked to find the general solution right so we have to understand that along with the equation if uh, one solution is given in the examination then we have to understand that the problem is related to rickettis equation so other thing is the equation will be of the form the equation will be of the form y dash equals to p of x y square so here p of x is 2x and q of x into y q of x is 1 minus 4x and r of x r of x is 2x minus 1 right so this is the given equation so first i'll write down given what is the given equation y dash equals to 2x into y square plus 1 minus 4x into y plus 2x minus 1 consider this equation as equation 1 so the procedure is we have to take the substitution so uh, put y equals to 1 plus 1 by z so to convert this equation to convert this uh, non linear equation we have to take this substitution y equals to 1 plus 1 by z then 
find differentiate this derivative of y is y dash derivative of 1 is 0 derivative of 1 by z is minus 1 by z square and derivative of z is z dash. So, finally, what we are getting here y dash equals to minus z dash by z square. So, we got uh, y because of this substitution and y dash from this y right then substitute everything in equation 1. So, from 1 what will happen y dash y dash is minus z dash by z square this is equal to 2x into y square what is y 1 plus 1 by z whole square plus 1 minus 4x 1 minus 4x into y what is y 1 plus 1 by z right plus 2x minus 1 2x minus 1 right. So, this is what we are getting from equation 1 when we take the substitution y equals to 1 plus 1 by z then y dash will be minus z dash by z square. So, here in place of y dash we are getting minus z dash by z square 2 x as it is y square in place of y 1 plus 1 by z whole square plus 1 minus 4 x into y is 1 plus 1 by z plus 2 x minus 1. Now, little bit simpl simplification. So, 2 x into a plus b whole square 1 plus 1 by z square plus 2 by z we will get right plus uh, multiply this 1 into 1 is 1 plus 1 into 1 by z is 1 by z then minus 4 x minus 4 x into 1 is minus 4 x then minus 4 x into 1 by z 4 x into 1 by z minus 4 x by z plus 2 x minus 1 right. So, further further you multiply this inside then what will happen 2 x plus 2 x by z square plus 4 x by z right plus 1 plus 1 by z minus 4 x minus 4 x by z plus 2 x minus 1. Now, we will see what are the terms that will get cancelled here 2 x is there here 2 x is there 2 x 2 x 4 x and here minus 4 x. So, this 2 x 2 x and minus 4 x will get cancelled here plus 1 is there here minus 1 is there. So, this plus 1 minus 1 will get cancelled here 4 x by z is there minus 4 x by z is there this will get cancelled. So, what will remain finally here 2 x by z square and plus 1 by z will remain left hand side minus z dash by z square will remain. Now, this minus z square so, what we are doing to uh, what we are going to do is we are going to convert the given Riccati's equation to linear form. What is the linear differential equation form d y by d x. So, I will I will write here. So, the linear equation form is d y by d x plus p of x into y equal to q of x. This is the most general form of linear differential equation that we have studied in lecture 16 right. Then integrating factor how to solve this we have to find the integrating factor integrating factor if you if you want clear information about this linear equation you can watch lecture 16 right integrating factor is e power integral p of x dx this is the integrating factor and general solution of this linear equation is given by y into integrating factor equal to integral of integrating factor into q dx plus c right this is the general solution of linear equation right we are going to convert this equation in linear equation in the variable z so let us uh, simplify this what will happen z dash equals to you take minus z square to right hand side then 2x by z square plus 1 by z so further simplification will give us uh, further you take minus z square inside then minus 2x z square z square will get cancelled this z square and z square will get cancelled here minus minus z square by z is nothing but minus z. So, further I will write this z dash as dz by dx and take this minus z to left hand side then plus z equal to minus 2 x right. So, you observe that this equation is reduced to linear form which is dz by dx plus p of x into z equals to q of x. So, which is linear in z. Which is linear in z. Right. 
Now, if the equation is linear, then we know how to solve it. We have to find the integrating factor, then general solution. So, integrating factor. So, linear in z and what, what is p of x here? p of x is, see you compare this equation with this equation. p of x is 1 here. So, p of x is 1 and q of x. What is q of x here? Right hand side, minus 2x is there. So, q of x is minus 2x. Therefore, what will be the integrating factor? Integrating factor equals to e power integral p of x dx, which is nothing but e power integral 1 dx. So, integration of 1 is x. So, e power x, integrating factor we are getting to be e power x, right? Then general solution. General solution of which equation? General solution of this equation, not the given equation. Consider this as consider this as equation 2. So, therefore, general solution of 2 is according to the linear equation, it is in, in place of y we are having z. So, z into integrating factor equal to integral of integrating factor into q dx plus c. Now, substitute everything here, z into integrating factor is e power x equal to integral of integrating factor is e power x and q is q is minus 2v sorry minus 2x into dx plus c. So, further this can be written as this is equal to minus 2 can be taken out what will remain x into e power x dx plus c this will remain minus 2 I have taken out then x into e power x is remaining consider this as first function consider this as second function right. <laughs> So, this is equal to we have to integrate, integrate by parts or apply Leibniz rule. So, what we do in applying Leibniz rule, first function, integration of second function. So, minus 2 into first function, integration of second function, integration of e power x is e power x only. Then minus, now this will be the first function, this will be second function. So, differentiation of first function, differentiation of first function is 1, integration of second function is e power x. Then plus differentiation of first function now differentiation of 1, differentiation of 1 will be 0. So, we should stop here, right? Then plus c, left hand side what is there? z into e power x, right? So, further simplify this, z equals to, what will happen? e power x can be taken out. So, minus 2 e power x, uh, left hand side I will write e power x as it is for one more step. So, z into e power x equals to minus 2, e power x is taken out, what will remain? x minus 1 will remain plus c. Now, z equals to e power x, this e power x and e power x will get cancelled. So, minus 2 into x minus 1 plus c into e power minus x because this e power x will come in the denominator of c. So, that is why e, e power minus x I am writing here. So, we got the value of z. Now, we need the solution of given Riccati's equation, right? Solution of this equation which is y. Right? What we have taken? We have taken the substitution y equals to 1 plus 1 by z and we found out what is z. So, substitute that z here then you will get the final solution. Therefore, the general solution of 1 is therefore, the general solution of equation 1 th that is the Riccati's equation is y equals to 1 plus 1 by z which is equal to 1 plus 1 by what is z? z is c into e power minus x minus 2 into x minus 1. So, this is the required general solution of given Riccati's equation. z I have, write, I have written from here. So, let me explain this once again. See what is the Riccati's equation? Riccati's equation form is y dash equals to p of x into y square plus q of x into y plus r of x, right? If r of x is 0, then Riccati's equation will become like this. If I rewrite this equation, then it is Bernoulli's equation and we know how to solve this. Uh, if you want the details of Bernoulli's equation, you can see lecture 17, right? Now, uh, if r of x is not equal to 0, for example, consider this question, y dash equals to 2x y square plus 1 minus 4x into y plus 2x minus 1. You see that this is p of x, this is q of x and this is r of x, right? So, as I told you along with the Riccati's equation, one particular solution will be given. Mostly it will be y equals to 1, y equals to 2 or y equals to x. Mostly these three solutions for any Riccati's equation will be given, right? 
what we have to do in the Riccati's equation we have to take substitution or transformation y equals to whatever the solution given that we have to write along with that we need to add 1 by z. This is the factor that will convert the given non-linear equation to linear right because y square is there so it is non-linear. So, 1 by z if we add then this will become linear differential equation right. When we take y equals to 1 plus 1 by z and differentiate we will get y dash equals to minus z dash by z square right. We have to take the substitution y and y dash in equation 1 and simplify then you will get this linear equation dz by dx plus z equals to minus 2x which is linear in z. P is 1 here q is minus 2x then we have to find the integrating factor which is e power x and general solution right. So, after doing all the simplifications we will get the value of z substitute the value of z in y then you will get the general solution of given equation right this is Riccati's equation.